Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Sarah, AKA Mediterranean Goddess. Um, I'm so happy to be here, you guys. I'm starting to feel better after contracting that nasty virus. So you guys stay safe, wash your hands a lot, clean your house, disinfect things that, are, that you touch a lot. Um, you know, make sure you're you're doing everything you can to protect yourself. I mean, if you choose, the masks, you know, they're, they are there to try to protect you and protect other people. Um, you know, do what you choose, but I'm just telling you what I'm getting from spirit about taking care of yourself. You guys, all my messages are pretty impromptu. Like, I meditate. And I, you know, I pray and stuff, but when I come on here, I just hit record and I say, let's go. And um, maybe, you know, as I get better and stuff, I'll do editing and stuff. But as for right now, I like to keep it as 100 as possible. Y'all, I don't got my nails done. It's all good. Um, what I want, I was doing some stretching and I got that. Um, in my spirit that for the collective, you guys, we need to really be, um, like stretching every day and, um, hydrating, making sure that we're hydrated and making sure that we're stretching. I don't know if you ha guys have like a foam roller or anything like that, but foam rollers are really good, um, when stretching as well. Um, it helps me a lot. Um, I got my drink, you guys, in my copper cup. <laughs> but I'll be drinking it because every time I do a reading, my throat chakra is usually closed up because a lot of um, twin flames are not in communication. And so I won't even notice till I go back and watch the video and I'm like, dang, I couldn't even speak. So <clears throat> I'm going to try to stay hydrated like I was saying to you guys. This is going to be a general twin flame reading. I got my shocker spray and I feel like I need to spray my hands with it. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, like I said, this is a twin flame reading. It's going to be a general reading for all signs of twin flames. I got some frankincense and myrrh um, lit up in the background. So if you see any smoke, that's the smoke you see. Um, I just wanna offer that up to spirit. And it gives like such a good cleanse for the house. And I got some Palo Santo going for you guys. And um, what did I wanna say? Oh, I don't know. Got my white candle. I'm just happy to be here. I'm happy to start feeling better, you guys. Uh, I'm probably going to do a few readings. Keep them short. You guys like them under 10, 15 minutes. And um, usually the message will continue in a different reading. It'll just like pick up again. Um, anyways, welcome, you guys. Welcome, welcome. Today, for this reading, I'm going to be using my deck as well as the True, True Heart Tarot deck, okay? So, I would just like to say, Spirit, speak through me about this twin flame dynamic that we're dealing with for the people that are watching and for myself. About that. Um, I think I'm going to start out with, okay, I'll start out with my deck and then I'm going to pull some from the tarot and then I will finish with my deck. All right, I haven't used my deck in a long time.
You guys, I saw date already two times. Date. Okay, so sometimes I'm like, should I do it for a divine feminine or should I do it for a divine masculine? So, because feminines, I know we want to know our masculine side, but we also have messages for ourselves. So I'm just going to let this be um, a, a mutual energy that intuitively spirit can reveal to me who, if it's for masculine or feminine. All right. I need to get like some regular tarot cards and write these messages on them because these index cards are hard to shuffle. They're flimsy. Okay, Spirit, what messages do you have for my collective watching? Okay, I think that should be good for now. Destiny, Twin Flame Destiny. Do you guys know it's part of the, it's part of your destiny. It's written, it's faded, written in stars, throat chakra. So divine masculines working on opening up their throat chakra. They have trouble expressing how they feel. You guys, let me look at these first because sometimes I get a message while I'm looking at them. So let me just. Mm, 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 mm. Wow. I don't know what to say. Block sh throat chakra. Like I said. So that's why they're silent, guys. <clears throat> they're silent because they don't know what to say. And they've been crying and purging. And they've been depressed. Because they know they rejected you and abandoned you. But feminine, you're a fighter. And you put a death to that bullshit of feeling abandoned. And you've been learning to love yourself and not abandon yourself. You have, you are remembering who you are and knowing that your past doesn't define you so that you're able to be abundant inside and out. And that's some good stuff. That's powerful. Okay, let's get some from the tarot. Dang, y'all, split the deck, four of wands. Shoot. Most of the time, I do not take reversals, you guys, unless I really feel to. So, just so you know. Spirit, can I have some cards out for the collective watching? So you can say what you need to say to them. Thank you. Mm, balance is needed, you guys. Balance. Temperaments, patience. You've been patient. You've been waiting a long time. You've been holding your ground this whole time. You've been having strength. Hanging on to what you believe in your heart. Becoming balanced within yourself. And that's what's going to bring in this Two of Cups offer. We got page of discs and um, two of cups. So an offer of love wants to come in and you've just been strong and patient and standing your ground. Good for you, dude. A couple more from the tarot. Longevity. Look at this. The balance comes in because you were 
ghosted, left out in the cold, broke as fuck. And now your abundance comes in because this is your destiny to have this 10 of pentacles. This is longevity, happy life, marriage, stability, family, long money, generational money. All right. Knight of Coins. Masculine wants to offer something. He just doesn't know how. He doesn't know how because he knows he fucked up so bad. This is a story for the most of us. All right. Can I get three cards out on what Divine Masculine feels in his heart for the feminine? Dang. That's a lot of cards. Take this one. He feels in his heart, family, moving forward, dashing forward, twin flame, the black and white sphinx. That's what he feels in his heart space. Can I get another card? I want the divine masculine feels in his heart space for the feminine. Is the divine masculine? That's a lot. I'll take these two, these three. Oh, this is adorable. You guys, the masculine feels like they rejected you and they missed out on this opportunity of love. And they want that opportunity of love with you and they're willing to work on it. They're willing to do what it takes. See, four of cups, ace of cups, eight of discs. That's really, really pretty. They know that they they missed out. They're spying on you too. Just always looking whenever they can. And they don't want to cover this rose that could bloom. This this ace of cups that they know that they could have with you. They're they're wanting to work on it. They don't want to cover that anymore. Okay, and then can I get a couple cards on the how the divine mass what okay. Divine Masculine's immediate action towards the feminine. Divine Masculine's immediate action towards the feminine. Divine Masculine's immediate action towards the feminine. Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment. Whew. Immediate action. Media action is they're coming full force, passionately, where they once was in and out. They're wanting to come forward and communicate and come to you and travel to you because they know that you are their stable queen. They know that you are their stable nurturer, their go-to person. Um... And they're wanting to come fast, you guys. I got Knight of Wands, Eight of Wands, and Queen of Discs, and this white bunny. You guys, there. it's like Alice in Wonderland. He's not on time. He has a lot of anxiety. He knows he's not on time. But he knows that you are his wish fulfillment. <clears throat> and look at this hauling ass with passion to his queen of discs okay i'm gonna get a couple more for my my deck like i said i was gonna do and then i'm gonna close this reading out i think i'm gonna do another one with the sexual tarot Thing that you want to say, spirit, to my divine counterparts watching.
Spirit, is there anything that us twin flames, masculines and feminines, <clears throat> that you want us to know about each other, about how we feel for each other? I guess I got a nice little, oh, that's a, oh, I was going to say I have a nice little stack, but now I have a genuinely nice stack. <clears throat> divine counterparts masculines and feminine you guys are promised ones you guys are the rainbow children of the world you guys are the promised ones this is a lot Here's that date again, you guys. I'm getting, um, take a risk when you're dating, even if it's not with your masculine. And even if it is with your masculine, take the risk and date. Guys, I'm just trying to read some of these before I start reading them to you. So we got telepathic thoughts, songs, and communication. So that's definitely a twin flame thing. Um, if you hear a song and, it, and, and you feel in your spirit that that's your masculine or your feminine speaking to you, it is. Okay. Masculine says, I thank God for you every night under the moonlight feminine. So I get that he stays up in his bed before he goes to bed and he just looks up at the ceiling or looks up at the stars or the moonlight and he just thanks God for even knowing you, even for all the lessons and just for knowing you. And you sh outshine all the other ba others, baby. So you stand out. But this is why his throat chakra is closed too. I'm insecure, you're out of my league. So uh, I'm getting that the feminines feel that way too. So feminines and masculines dealing with insecurity. Mm. Feminines, you are where you are meant to be. I know that a lot of the times we want to hurry up and move through our story, but each step matters, each moment matters, and we are to listen to our intuition and to bask in the moment of our lives, okay? Um, and have understanding towards not just our, our masculines, but having understanding for ourselves um, because sometimes, you know, people get stuck in the mud. The masculine, you were feminine, you were stuck in the mud. And sometimes you still get stuck in the mud. And masculine, you stuck in the mud. Okay, but we have to have understanding towards one, each, one another. And um, hmm. Masculines, they see the feminine as very pure. And we are because we have a league of angels protecting us. So we are divinely protected feminines. We are the promised ones. And karmic patterns, karmic thoughts. So... Anything, when I see karmic patterns ending, the spell is broken. Literally, black magic spells are broken. But literally, uh, the negative hold of bad patterns of thinking of people that don't serve you, it's, it's, it's over. All that crap is over. So if the masculine wants to be in the feminine's life, uh, he's going to have to do the same things too. So, so 
karmic patterns ending on, on both sides. And then look at the last card, you guys. I'm ending with this. Because suddenly, a sudden tower moment, giving material blessings and money in a honeymoon stage. Okay? So, when you let go, which I think I said this in my last video, is when you let go of that old stinking thinking, suddenly you manifest what you've been wanting, which is a honeymoon, I say, a trip with, with your masculine or just being in that honeymoon stage or um, a period of sweetness after sorrow and having blessings and material money. And I just thank you so much for tuning in, you guys. Thanks for still watching me. Um, some people are going to judge and they're not going to follow me anymore. I honestly do not care. So thank you for being here. If you're meant to be here, you're meant to be here. And I do ask that you like, share, and subscribe so I can up my subscribees. I mean, I don't really care about the numbers, but I would like to reach more than, you know, five people. But I thank you guys, you five people, for being here anyways. So thank you and have a great day. Bye.